We're going to switch gears a little here. It proved to be a shocker on the final episode of Survivor Samoa last night as the Texan oil man was blindsided by an out-of-work pharmaceutical saleswoman. Oh my gosh, a rocker is sick. A rocker is sick. Anyone who judged 26-year-old Natalie White by her looks oh made a big mistake. Crazy. Early on, her teammates discounted her as an empty-headed beauty queen, but she truly had killer instincts. Oh gosh, oh my word. Oh, I'm sorry. My strategy was to build good relationships, be underestimated, and be the last one standing. She formed an early alliance with this season's master manipulator, Russell. My tribe will believe anything I tell them uh, at any point because they're just stupid. You can call me the puppet master. They can be my little puppets. They'll run when I tell them to run. They'll walk when I tell them to walk. When I'm finished with them, I just throw them in the trash. By some accounts, Russell may have been the greatest player in Survivor history, but he made a fatal mistake. He had too many enemies on the jury. You played an unethical game. Admittedly played an unethical game. Natalie, people will call you weak. People will say that you are undeserving. Why are those characteristics any less admirable as lying, cheating, and stealing? They took their revenge on Russell and rewarded Natalie for playing the game beautifully. The winner of Survivor Samoa.